Do you see this? These are my crazy eyes. And uh, they're like red. I'll well, use this eye, I guess. They're red. And they get purple, blue. And for some reason, I'm turning yellow. People, please don't tell me I'm getting jaundice. I just don't need to hear that right now. Um, but I've... Hang on, let me pick a damn more flattering angle. This hurts. As you can see, my wife has been terribly busy and hasn't had a chance to cut my hair. We're fucking cheap, and she cuts it, so I look like Wolverine. Whatever, get over it. You, that's why I usually wear a hat. Um, I feel like crap. The doctors put me on um, a new host of medicine to try to get care of. The vomiting. Um, we have the nausea, I would say 60-65% under control. Um, and it gets worse when I'm on antibiotics. I, I know, um, I think a few of you are doing IV antibiotics, and I, I don't know if anybody subscribes to me, oddly enough, that has gone through chemo, and I, I, the one person I've talked to has told me that this happens, but, um, when I do a saline flush, I get instantly nauseous. Um, I don't know if that's because I've had so many treatments that I've gotten sick, but saline flushes, if you've never had one, taste terrible and there's no possible way to describe it if you've never had one and if you haven't be very thankful but um i get instantly sick and now um that my body is hurting so much um drugs that in the beginning didn't make me sick at all or i had very little reaction to i now have um very 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 strong um nauseous reactions to we have to run bags really slow or i'll just get up and puke uh, we were doing anti-parasites this week, met, met, Mepron, and I'm not even going to try to say the other, but it starts with the word art, and uh, ends with, I think, men menisizin. The wife is totally going to correct me because I say it wrong every time. I also say wrong a lot of other words, like I say mandarin oranges, and I um, made up the, a couple of other words um, that Gina now has copyright to. If you hang out with me and stick them, you get copyright to my words. What do I tell you? You know? Um, so we're trying, um, a suspension, which I have to take an ungodly amount of, so frighteningly enough that there are three fucking bottles of it for a month. And not little teeny bottles, I mean like big, you know, almost like a half a liter bottles or something. It tastes like, for those of you who had like a, a contrast, um, CT scan where you have to drink the chalky chalk, it tastes like cherry chalk, it's awesome. So when you're nauseous, it's like the last thing you want to drink to try to make you unnauseous. Um, Zofran works, but I have to take about nine pills a day for it to work because my body is now like, uh, Zofran's kind of okay, but you're going to give me a lot of it. Um, there's been a lot going on just everywhere. Um, I do know I've talked about Bella and a couple other things, and I've just been very stressed out and not sleeping, and so... Um, I'm taking Valium in wee fistfuls. Two points for anybody who gets that, who gets that, uh, little teeny tiny piece of trivia from theater or television. Um, taking very little of it because it knocks my ass out. It doesn't really cure my anxiety, but it knocks my ass out, which... When everybody else in the house has their ass knocked out, it's about the first thing I want to take. So, that's where that's from. Fun. Uh, I joked a long time ago about the fact that a doctor would never put me on a drug called Marinol, which is basically... I haven't read enough on it, but it, it takes the... It's marijuana without the smoking or... It's missing the THC. Your eyes... Somebody will know more than I will because I've been too tired to even research the damn thing. I do know that taking two a day for a month costs almost $200. Um, I got six days worth and it cost about $19. Six days worth. No, three days worth. Six pills. Six pills. $20. $3.50 per pill. So we're ordering it through Medco and we should be able to get a 90-day supply for like $35. Woo! My mom's a federal employee. I have good insurance, but it doesn't help. 
because my doctor doesn't take it. <laughs> I'm not complaining at all. Um, sorry, I'm messing my hair. I'm really tired. Um, I couldn't go to rehearsal today for various reasons. I'm feeling bad. If I got in a car, I would vomit. And I feel really bad because um, tonight is Jackie's dad's birthday. And they're doing dinner, which... A, sadly, personally, that's really sad for me because... I mean, she's going to be gone an extra, like, four fucking hours and I'm going to be stuck here by myself. Um, two, it means she left the retard in the room. I don't mean that in a bad way. We just call Keely Tard and she's fine until she starts to try to jump on the bed and God knows what else. <sighs> Bella's downstairs. She's doing pretty well. After a week, she's already walking. Walking like a person who's had way too much tequila, but walking. Um, I think we're eight days on, nine days out of surgery now. She goes in next week, next week to see the doctor halfway through her rehabilitation. Um, I get two nice cards from my wife. I don't know where she found them, but they look exactly like our dogs in a very odd way. Anyway, um, I don't know what else to say. Uh, I don't have a lot of interesting things going on in my life. I'm watching uh, a lot of Television online, Grey's Anatomy, House, Private Practice because it's on, Pushing Daisies, The L Word comes out on October 28th, we'll be there to buy it at Target, like always, there will be a marathon at our house because we don't have television or showtime, um, I'm watching some stuff on Netflix, thank God for Netflix, and, uh, I look like a psycho. Which is why I shouldn't go on in public. And if I had any money right now. Well, last night was really bad because I took a Marinol and I didn't want to tell anybody. But I ate like the most I've ever eaten in probably six weeks. I had um, a sub for dinner. We had a cake tasting for, I don't even know if we've talked about this. Uh, we're doing a five-year anniversary party for us the day after Thanksgiving, a week after our anniversary. Our anniversary actually falls on Gina's birthday, go figure. Um, uh, so we're, we're doing that and we're playing that. We went to go do a cake testing. It was really great. Um, I think every piece of cake that we wanted to try, they would bring out. We ended up with seven pieces of cake and Jackie's sister came. So we sent home cake with her and we took home cake and... My mom couldn't make it, so we took cake to my mom last night, and Bella to my mom's last night, so I had cake. And then I came home, and I decided that I wanted some Cheetos that randomly I had stolen from a band hospitality show that we went to this weekend. They had this thing called Director's Hospitality, which means if you teach, you automatically get free food at shows. It's kind of a bonus thing. But I'd taken the Cheetos home for some reason, so... I was really excited. I ate the bag of Cheetos. I ate two spoonfuls. We got one of these tubs of Toll House cookie dough. And um, I think we've eaten more of the cookie dough than we've baked. It's really pathetic. I ate some cookie dough and I put some buttercream whipped icing on top of it. I mean, it was messed up. And I didn't really want this stuff. I wasn't, I don't know if I was eating for a board. I don't know, I was watching movies. But I was just eating and about 3 a.m. um oh and I ate, I ate a pop tart I ate two pop tarts I ate a lot of pop tarts that was in sure downstairs and I could have eaten that I guess that would have been more intelligent anyway I guess not because I've puked up in sure and it killed it for me for like three months anyway about 3 a.m. um all the food decided that it was going to revolt and um I'm not really sure how that marinol stuff's working on the vomiting uh, but I do know that they give it to patients with severe weight loss, and about every time I've gone into the clinic, I've lost anywhere from 3 to 7 or 8 pounds. Um, I have hip bones now. It's freakish. Anyway, I'm going to go. This is getting damn near long. Um, I hope you guys are all well. I hope nobody has creepy eyes like me. And, uh, yeah. Take care. I'll try. <laughs>